welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for joining me. So this week I'm going to be sharing a function on Canva which is called mockups, which I find really, really useful. So if you're interested in hearing about this, then please keep on watching. Okay, so this week I'm going to be showing you where mockups is, a function that we use in Canva that can help generate all sorts of different types of pictures and different situations. So I'm just going to move myself a little bit out of the way. Uh, let me just stand, let me just create a basic design. Let's just go for an Instagram post. So we're just going to go for an Instagram post that's kind of a standard size. And let me make myself a little bit smaller so I'm out of the way. So first of all, we have to go to our upload. So I've got some photos here from different workshops that I've held. And let's choose a lovely photo. What about this one? I love this one with all the smiles. So let's just make that a little bit bigger so that you can actually see it. Now, if we go to edit video, you'll see that last week I talked about the magic edit button, which means that you can kind of change the picture, whether it's clothes or hats, sunglasses, you've got filters here, you've got different effects. But then one of the apps that I have here is called mockups. So if we click on mockups, you'll be able to see already pre-made templates of where you can insert this particular picture. So let's just have a look at uh, all the different categories. We've got the popular ones, which I imagine we're going to explore in a minute. We've got smartphones, computers, tablets, TVs, home living, apparel, print, packaging, frames, and branding. So let's go to the popular ones. What are the most popular mock-ups? Oh, this is cute. The little drink bottles, the iPhones. Uh, and then let's choose one to have a look at. What about this one? I quite like this one, someone holding it. So you've got this here as the mock-up. You've got to pick up your picture and make sure you insert it inside the actual mock-up. So you can see that the AI is actually thinking and it's inserted it into the mock-up photo that you have here. So I think that these mock-ups are so good to use as templates if you're designing uh, resources or any kind of promotional or branding material, or even it can be a very eye-catching photo, a mock-up of your class so that you get them excited about the unit that's to come. So I was really excited to discover the mock-ups on Canva. There are still so many functions that I'm exploring on Canva. I hope that you find mock-ups really useful in your workflow. Thank you so much for joining me this week and I hope to see you next time. Bye.